do you think you are? You're just a petty detective. What was that hand gesture there? Greetings everybody, this is Daddy the Grand, the Grand Daddy, and today we're playing Loop Mancer. I saw the game on Steam, this is the demo version of it, and it looked like I would like it. It reminded me a lot of Anno Mutation, which we've played on stream before, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Despite this only being a demo version, there's apparently already different modes in here, huh? I'm gonna go for normal mode. I have no idea how this game functions, what the controls are. So I think that is going to be a smart decision to make. 9%? Not sure what that is referring to. 30... Okay, we're loading. We're loading. I see. The world was in desperate need of a sanctuary after the war ended. Immigrants, refugees and corporations have all set their eyes upon Dragon City. Longshi Town was rebuilt as a haven to vent social conflicts and eliminate possibilities of future warfare. 20 years later... Dragon City became one of the most advanced cities in the world, but the residents of Longshi Town still revealed in this close lawless ghetto, ignorant of the fact that they were trapped in the hellhole. That was actually a little bit hard to read on the white background there. Let's go. Loading is over. Every now and then my mouse pops back on the screen, even though I keep pushing it away. I want to play this with the controller. This already looks very good though. Long sheet town. We are 24 years in the future. And we are still using katanas, I see. Okay, that's fine. Okay. And that is our main character. Looking good, well built, bionical arm, because of course. I have been busting my ass. Ah, they are friends. They have the handshake down. I brought you a weapon. Well, didn't you already give it to me in the office? I felt that might not be enough. Think about it. You sent Wei Long to jail five years ago. Mm -hmm. But now, he ain't a punk no more. Guy's the head of Long Shi Gang. He hated your guts for sure. Uh -huh. Today, his gang is hosting the Parade of Panate. His men gonna jam the street. Is he gonna cooperate with your investigation? Not a chance. It's gonna be ugly. Thanks, man. I appreciate the concern. Never mind. <laughs> Long Shi Town is a party today. The streets are full of food. I can't get I over the fact the that the Here. lips don't sink. This is for you. It is such a weird thing to be very aware of, but I just can't get careful, over it. Man. If the chump and his men make a fuss, I also can't help but feel that this guy over here doesn't just sound do do. like he looks. You know I can handle myself. You're right. Still, be careful. I'll I feel like his voice either needs Later. to be a lot deeper. Or a little bit higher. A pork in town. That's out of this world. <laughs> I feel like he needs to go very hard on one of those extremes. Okay, so this is 2D. I can jump. I can double jump. And I have this melee weapon. And the car I came in. The flying car. I just drove off. I can shoot. I should probably not do that in the open. Okay, this I like. And I feel like you don't see this all that often. When you air dash, you still have downward momentum. So we actually dash down like that. That's actually very nice. I don't remember the last game that actually did that. So, I got a summoner bar. I pushed the directional buttons that did something. Ah, it's a reload. I see, I see. Shoulder buttons. Okay, apparently I can use the force to shoot some lightning. And... I'm gonna ignore that. Okay, what you got, girly? What you got? What button do I need to push? Hi there, oh, this one. Zushu. I'm Mona, the senior mission intel agent on this case. Hello, Mona. I'm Greetings, Mona. Pleased to meet you. Liu Xin is my supervisor. Mm -hmm. You saw many well-known cases with her. I'm honored to be part of your team. That's good. You should <laughs> You're be. You're being too polite. No, no, she's just Yang right. Long is currently at the bridge and enjoying the pageant with his underlings. Keep going and cross the barricade. You'll see him once you get down there. Given your skills, this shouldn't be a problem. Okay, Thank you. I'm very skilled. What do you know about the Parade of Penate? The city god of Longshi Town embarks on his annual tour on the fifth day of the sixth month of the lunar calendar. Mm -hmm. People also call it the Parade of Penate. To ensure a year of fortune free of calamities. Temple crews will organize a rich and powerful parade along the canal. Mm -hmm. The Longshi gang grew pretty quickly in the past few years. They donated vast sums for three years running. This fest cost them $50 million alone. That's quite the sum. 
That bit of intel is actually quite useful. I will keep an eye out on things, and update you as we go along. Be safe. I'll see you later. You, you might. You just might see me later. So I'm gonna make a promise right here, right now. I'm gonna promise you it will take me forever to actually remember all of that going down. There's floaty stuff coming to me. No idea what that's gonna do, but we're gonna ignore it. And what is this? Press left mouse button to sprint. Sprinting cost stamina. Ah, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. So I have to step on this. That's gonna make that one move around. Then I have to sprint all the way in order to get through. I have to maybe wait a little bit long until the gate is fully opened. Now I should be able to make it, right? Yeah, easy. What is this? When you see the icon, you can jump on this platform. Oh, that's nice. Logistics terminals. Logistics terminals are scattered throughout the map and will auto-activate when you're close enough. Press and hold the button to heal for some HP at the terminal. That's nice. When you clear stage, all logistic terminals you used will lose some HP healing capacity. That sounds weird. Press that button to spend cores and reset HP healing capacity of every terminal in the stage. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. I think I get it. I think I get it. Press the button to open the map and teleport to another activated terminal. So this is basically just some kind of safe spot that also heals or repairs me, whatever that means. Oh, repairing means just making the shift there. I see. Mazamune has damage and a so-called ultra counter, which sounds very impressive. PUT machines. PUT machines are scattered throughout the map. Invest enough E-coins in them to unlock a specific weapon. Investments and unlocking are permanent and will not disappear when you die. When you meet a PUT machine with an unlocked weapon, you'll get that weapon for free. Well, that's nice. The trader and Dave Ray only provide weapons you're unlocked. Fine. So... If I push the button now, I will transfer stuff that I might have. I have 1,400. Okay. Do I have 1,400? I only need to spend... I'm not sure what I'm doing. Invested 41 E-coins in Unlocked Mazamune. I don't even know how many E-coins I had. Ah, okay. I think I know how many. I saw where that symbol was before. So I need 1,400. That's gonna take a while. That's going to take quite a while in order to get there. What is this? Uh-huh. Ah, I'm crouching. I see. I'm crouching. I'm crouching. Okay, okay, cool. Use ammo crates to replenish your ammunition. Sure. Did it. And what is this? Check. Leaks. Parade of Penny. Ah, this is just a lore point. Okay, I'm not gonna read that. I am not gonna read it. I'm gonna crouch over here. I wonder what happens if I step on that, though. Ah, I see. I fall through that. Great. Did it do anything for me, though? Probably the way I need to go. And pavilions and stacks. Hello, Waylong. You look like you've seen better days. But he seems very... Do you oh, see that well, smile? If it isn't a great <laughs> detective, Xiong <laughs> Zixiu. To what do I owe this pleasant surprise? I'm sure you didn't come all this way just to see our little holiday celebration. This reporter's name is Lizbeth. Hot. She I agree. Two days ago. It's too bad I never got to see her with my own eyes. Did any of you see her? Never saw her, boss. You hear that? Now there's nothing else. Piss off. Oh come on, we had a good conversation going on here. You're the last person she interviewed. I said you can piss off. You may have heard, we're investigating a murder involving several of your people. If you don't mm -hmm. cooperate, I can move this up the chain. Then come back with a search warrant and take you down. If we do it that way, I'm afraid your extravagant parade of penate. Screw you! You think you can threaten me on my own turf? Apparently it think thinks I that, yes. About our grudge from five years ago. Instigates a murder mystery that involves Real you. Careful. That is certainly the way. Okay. Need to be a little bit more investigative about their attacking tails. Yeah, 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 ultras. Okay, every melee weapon has a special attack known as the ultra. Hit enemies and reach the 
counter. And then you have to push L plus R to cast it. Okay, fine. That was quite the ultra. Sent them flying. The good old dash and slash. I see how it is. I see how it is. I'm not sure if and where I see a bar that tells me how full that meter is. What's this? No, it's challenges. After clearing certain combat zones in the stage, challenges will appear on the left side of the screen. Try clearing these challenges for more rewards. Okay. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. You good? Don't shoot. Searing for shoot. Robot. Why do you know? Me? There's robots in this I game, of course. Actually, Cyborgs, my mistake. And I'm a black market dealer. I know Dave Ray from your office. You know mm -hmm. Dave? How? I have a store at the North Martel Market of Dragon City. Dave pays me occasional visits to buy a few weapon chips or parts you can't get from the open market. Mm -hmm. North Wakyang is the place for chips, circuitry, and other electronic parts. Techie like him who just arrived at Dragon City must feel as though he's hit a gold mine. Why are you here? I do business, and business is always better in troubled places. You that is not wrong. With the Lucy gangsters. Do you want to check out my wares? They'll help you. Fine. Let me take a look. But first things first. I gotta tell you that Lucy gangsters buy things from me as well. Mm -hmm. You're quite a businessman, I guess. I suppose you'll sweep the battlegrounds afterwards for weapons and loot. Okay, now I wonder if that is just something he told me, or if that is going to be an actual game mechanic of sorts. Like, assume you buy something from him. Will that mean that other enemies will also buy that? Yeah, I know, 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 I know. Skip, 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 skip. We already had that bit of conversation. What's this? You see the flashing red crane shaped icon. Press R1 to swing yourself to the destination. Ah, I see. I see, they gave me a grappling hut. That's nice. Notes, e-coins, need a better weapon? Yes! Pick up. No supplies required, okay, that's just a... ammo crate. Fine. I can't afford any of these things. Salted fish. Salted fish made by Aunt Chu at the farmed river mouth of Lingxi Town. Hard, solid, salty, razor sharp, delicious and useful. An essential part of your traveling kit and murderous schemes. So you're telling me I can actually have a fish as a weapon, huh? Doesn't look like I can afford it though. Nah, 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 nah. I'm not gonna buy that just because I don't actually have the e-coins for that. There's no point in spending e-coins for stuff that I can't actually have. Oh, hi there, buddy. Yeah, you have seen better days of that, I am certain. Fucking hell. Oh, come on. Language! Starting to understand the flow of combat in this game. Let's check this. Knockback. Knockback enemies can still be attacked. The same will still apply to you as well. Death comes quickly to the careless. I mean, I, would tr I don't think I needed a hint for that. Let's, let's, let's say that. I feel like I would have tried out hitting an enemy that is already knocked back naturally. And I think I would have found out that they are taking damage from that. He's blocking. But not for long. What is this? Flame shrapnel. Another thing I need to spend E dollars for, huh? E coins, my mistake. There's no dollars in here, it's E coins. I am not going to do that in here. Easy money. The dash feels really, really good. It feels really, really nice to use. And so does the regular attacks. Now, getting striked down by that explosion. Now, that did not feel good at all. No, where's the enemy? There you are, buddy. I am not gonna eat everything. Did you just call me fuckhead? What do you think you are? Trevor's touchdown or what? No, 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 no. I resent the notion. What is this? Boost orbs designed to optimize bionic performance? Sure. Resilience. Increase my max HP or increase my melee combat damage? I don't think I have a, an idea how much 5 HP actually is. Let's go for ferocity. 
Like, I see my HP bar, but I do not see how much HP that constitutes. Maybe in my starting menu somewhere. One buff's acquired. Settings, archives, restart, quit game. Nah, I have no idea how much HP I actually have. Like, 5 HP could be humongous, right? I could be sitting at 3 HP right now. That one grenade was hitting me for about one third of my HP, so that could be the thing. It could also mean that I have, I don't know, a hundred, and I was getting it for 33 of my HP or so. The thing is, I don't know. Oh, there. Uh, I have to push up, right? Yeah, there we go. There's another check. Exploding barrels. When I attack, exploding barrels will start burning, then explode. Yeah, I noticed. I noticed. I learned that the hard way. Oh, hi. He actually got an attack in there. Oh, no. I died. Over ten minutes later? I didn't die. I thought I died. But I did. Oh, it's fine. Sure. I'll catch you and break your damn legs. There's a cat. Well, it's good to know that we still have cats in this cyberpunk universe. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, was was that the demo? Was it being shot down? And that's it? It might be. I don't know. Again, this is just a demo. That's not the full game. So uh, a lot of things could happen in here that we are not fully aware of. Right now, there's some loading going on. So I believe there's going to be a little bit more. Um, Thompson Group includes Thompson Technology that focuses on R&D as well as Thompson Realtors. Okay, I don't care that much about Thompson. And we are fully loaded. First Aerial Highway East. That was 2045, right? I think the game earlier was 2046. So we are now in the past. That is me. That is a girl. There is a smaller girl. And there is a crash. And there was a pet. Anal River Community. Okay, that was that was a nightmare. Probably a bad memory too. Tutorial. Death and loops. Every time he dies, Shang Shizhu will wake up at this apartment and everything will reset to the state it was in the morning of 2046 July 8. The detective, however, would retain his memories. Make use of the knowledge and intel you gather to make better decisions in the new loop. Choices matter and would affect story progress and the fate of key characters. Starting a new loop may change the maps, stages, puzzles and story. Okay. Sure. Can you swing by the office today? There's a case that needs your expertise. We already know about that case. That was a cool transition, by the way. Tutorial evidence board. Uh, Shinsu is still investigating the accident that killed his daughter. Oh, it was his daughter. Of course it was. As you progress through the story, more intel info will be unlocked on the evidence board. The board leads you. Uh, lets you view the relationships between key characters. Check various stage progress and statistics. Check gameplay statistics. View impressions you get. It's just a status menu. I get it now. Fine. Let's see. This is the detective office. That's probably why I work. And we have probably already spoken to some of these characters. Koga Industry, Longshi Gang. This is the people we have interacted with early on. Fully understanding this is still a demo. This is not that many persons. Right? There's like, what, 4, 9, 30 persons. I mean, it's still quite a bit. But m I expect there to be more in the final bit of the game. I killed 18 persons yesterday. Probably gonna do that today again. And that's it for this board. So I like how this looks and plays over here. I would have loved a smoother transition between these two. Right? That you go from here... And a smooth camera transition over here. That would have been huge. What is this? Oh, it's a cat. It's a cat. Hello there. Max health increase. Really? That works? Oh, I take it. I take it. If every time I pet a cat, my HP gets improved. Hi, it's me. Hello, me. This isn't anything important. I saw the mail you sent me. Mm-hmm. I don't want to undergo the spinal neurosurgery you mentioned. 
I know you want the best for me. And I know this new tech looks pretty effective. But, but please, just let me think about it for a while. Yeah, sure. Take your time. Not too long, though. Oh, my man ass. My God, can we talk about how this apartment is looking? First of all, this is his bedroom slash living room slash workstation. This is large. And look at that huge window over here. And then you come over here. He has an entire training section going on in here as well. Got the bench and all that stuff. There's another desk. Uh, previous challenge. Spend course to unlock or improve Shang Shishu's various abilities. Survive abilities, economy, and combat. Okay. Confirm. So we can uh, give us more increase to, to maximum health. Another increase, another increase, add maximum potential. Probably gonna be necessary later down the line. Where is HP bottle carrying limit? Interesting. And apparently we have those. Let's remember that for later. Add more maximum stamina. Got it. Balance guarantee. Retains some previously collected econs after reviving. Probably going to be useful. Just in order to buy stuff. And melee deflect. Oh, they're gonna... Of course they're gonna give me a parry. Because of course they do. But I can't afford it. I don't have that kind of money on me. Can't afford any of these. Change outfits? Of course I have different outfits. I need to. That's the worn jacket we currently use. I, is that the same thing I wore earlier? No, I don't think it was. Torn trench coat? I love how he is actually rocking that. Ooh, I look so good in a trench coat pose, <laughs> pose here. He knows what he's doing. Race jacket. Explorer's jacket. Kung Fu shirt. Because everybody's Kung Fu fighting. Na, 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 na. I do like the fine west, though. Casual pants. Jeans. Racer pants. Smarty pants. Kung Fu <laughs> hoses. Uh, I do like the the, 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 the the fine west. But I'm not really seeing any pants that really fit together with those. I hope they will fix that up later. Alright, what is this? Check. It's a journal. Seven months since we got into a car accident. Well, that sucks. Anything else we can do in here? Like, you can, you see, there's actually a lower area in here as well. So you can assume that this apartment continues there. There's another leg bang area over here. Have we seen the kitchen? Have we seen the kitchen in here? I don't think we have. Maybe it's that in the back. That might be. It's a bit dark there, but it looks like it might be. And then you leave the house and you got your flying car immediately here. Look at this city, though. Like, maybe that's just me, but that's actually one thing that I love the most about cyberpunk games. Those incredible city views. Okay, let's, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go restart that loop. So I thought there would be some kind of demo version that would just be over at some point, but maybe it actually allows me to replay these stages all the time. That would be kind of nice. That actually would be kind of nice. Now let's see where we go. Shang Shu Detective Office. Here we are. This thing looks very cool. This is flying car. I really like it. Not a big fan of the boots though. I wish I maybe it's a bit too much to ask, but I wish these transitions here would be smooth. I mean, for this small section, it's actually fine-ish. I'm not even sure if this needs to transition like this. This would have been fine without two. Alright, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who wants to talk? It's you. The shoe. You. I like the Finally shirt. Come. It's been a while. How have you been? I know. Died. Came back. Loop time. The shoe. You're finally here. Sorry to call you in on a Sunday. <laughs> it's actually Sunday for me too. After all this time away, you're treating me like a stranger now. You're in a much better mood than I expected. I can't stay depressed forever. Anyway, what case was too hard for the great Liu Shi? The great Another Liu Shi. The reporter went missing after her vehicle was hacked. She's a reporter with the Dragon City Daily and the mayor's daughter. Mm -hmm. The mayor is a good friend and college classmate of the director. This reporter was like a daughter to him. Wait. This reporter. What's her name again? Lisbeth. Lisbeth. Yes. Do you know her? I don't know her. But what I'm about to say might surprise you. Oh, don't tell her about the time looping. Is the last person she interviewed. 
You piqued my curiosity, and now you have my attention. This is a new case. Who gave you this intel? I was startled awake this morning by a dream. Mm -hmm. I remember it vividly. I went to Long Shi Town to look for Wei Long and investigate this case. You mean you dreamt of looking for Wei Long in Long Shi Town? <laughs> Quit messing around and tell me who gave you the intel. I'm not joking. I'm confused too. I'll just have to talk to Wei Long in Long Shi Town. <sighs> Go on, keep messing with me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> being held in Long Shi Town today. The event is sponsored by the Long Shi Gang. Yeah, we know that already. One more thing. As you already know, Wei Long is the last person that Lisbeth interviewed. Yes. There's bad blood between you from five years ago, and now he's the head of the Long Shi Gang. There's no way he will cooperate willingly. Sounds Head likely. Dave Ray's in a bit to get a weapon. Understood. I'll leave soon. I sent the detailed brief to the terminal outside the office for you. Remember to give it a read. Go upstairs and check in with the director <sighs> before you leave. Great. All right. Liu Xing has intel or the knowledge you've learned to choose your next stage. Okay, fine, fine, fine. We're gonna do that later down the line. So first of all, this was apparently the first loop this character has ever done. And it is a phenomenon that he himself can't explain. So it's basically Groundhog Day. There's Dave Ray. Hey, I've seen you before. So we don't know what is going on with that. It could be one of those cases where we're just actually in a simulation of sorts. Which would be funny. It could be one of those stories where it's actually just a dream or he has some kind of superpower. I do not know. Hello there, director. Sure, you're back. Yes, I am. On a Thank Sunday. You for coming back for this case. Sure, you're back. You said Hi, that. Director. It's been a while. You lost weight. I take it Liu Xin already filled you in on the case brief? She did. Yes. I'm going to start investigating soon. To be honest, this case puzzles me. Many reporters have gone missing, and not a single one of them has been found. I so maybe they're still around? Grow up. Please, do everything you can to help. Don't worry. I'll do everything I can to bring Lisbeth back. Sure. Anything else to say? To be honest, this case puzzles me. Yeah, okay, you said, you said, you said, you said, you said that already. Repeating dialogue. I know what it is. I was hoping that maybe I could question him, get some more information out of him, but I guess I was wrong. So, we have to see Dave in order to get a weapon again. Weapon unload. What did the voice say? Weapon unload. I don't get it. Uh, weapon something, I think. There's some um, robots or cyborgs in the back. And the equipment file. Ah, I see, I see, I see, I see. That is the bionic arm. We can actually punch with that one too. Red not even when being unarmed. Advance with courage and that's how you win. Sounds good to me. There's the gun we have. We barely used it before. The speed pistol. High performance semi-automatic pistol manufactured by MA Plant 2. And we have tactical gear. What is this? The mine. Oh, I didn't know I had mines. Explodes when an enemy enters its AoE and it deals AoE damage. And skill jab. Seismic palm. Looks interesting. And arc. Oh yeah, we have seen arc. That was not hey, the arc I had before. You're finally back. I've heard you're going to Long Shi Town to take out the most ruthless gang there. Got something good for you. As a gun. Just think of it as a welcome gift. Oh, you're so good to Let's me. See what you can do. You are so rude to me. Okay, fine. I'll take it. Oh, wait, wait, that's actually free stuff for me, huh? Is it all free? I wonder. More damage, more damage. A lot more magazine capacity and reserve. And less damage. Okay, we have to pick one of those. We're probably gonna pick the one that has more damage, right? But it has a very low amount of maximum ammo, I'm not sure. But I already use it very barely, so we might as well. Now it is the speed pistol, the one we had before. I see, so we can just make the switch in here. By the way, I don't even pretend like I don't get a Man in Black reference when it's being thrown on my head like that. I can actually have a... This is actually a flying axe, huh? But it looks like it doesn't deal a lot of damage. It's actually not a fl... 
Is that not a flying axe that I'm using? Ah, I see. This is a skill. This is a skill of some sort. Okay, how do you use it? How do I use that one? Ah, oh, okay. That's the mine. And if I pick this one up... <laughs> I see. I see. I see. Okay, as limited ammunition charges. How many mines would I have? Twelve. Okay, fine, fine, fine. This is not the same sword I had before, right? There's more of a knifey thing we got going on in here. Interesting. Can I use this to switch it over to the fist? Doesn't seem like I can. Maybe if I go to the menu. Because I want to punch my enemies with my fists. That's what I want to do. It doesn't seem like I can make the switch. Sad. Okay, let's go. My man. I missed you. I missed you too, buddy. Good to see you. You find me new food during my absence? I'm glad you asked. I've been bugging Liu Xin since you've been gone. Mm -hmm. She says I'm making her gain weight from all the food. <laughs> oh, great. My diet has taken a significant hit. So, did you take Lizbeth's case? You're still in great shape there, buddy. Now, I need your weapon support. No problem. I've got your firepower covered. Just let me know if you're looking for any weapons or upgrades. There's bad blood between me and Wei Long. We know that. So he is not likely to cooperate. What weapon do you think I should use to persuade him? I prepared some weapons. For Music stopped playing. I just realized that. All reliable. Pick whichever you like. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Okay. I see. I see. I see. Now we can talk business. As a skilled mechanist and your steadfast ally, you can upgrade the weapon you wield. So that's the weapon. We can spend some e coins in order to make the uh, the knife better. I would have preferred to have just my fists in here. Just because it is nice to have a bionic fist. But maybe that is something for another day. Black Cat and Death Warning. Let's go. Oh, am I gonna drive myself? I cannot doubt that. But it would be nice. It would be nice to be allowed to drive. I have my driver's license. Every now and then I would like to use it too. And another loading screen. These loading screens are pretty, pretty long. It's nice that they give you a little bit of lore to read as they happen, though. Yeah, yeah, I was just speaking about the lore. The world was in desperate need of a sanctuary after the war ended. We have already read that. After all, they were the ones who tilted the drums of war. The ruins of war. Gave the homeless refugees a roof over their heads and built the world's largest, most complex and packed ghetto in the world. Oh, that's rough. That's very, very rough. But the loading is over and now we can go back to the game. Okay, this is where we started previously. This is where we started previously. We went to the office at, I think, 10 a.m. I have no idea what we supposedly did for the last 10 hours or so. But now we are here to reclaim our life, our fate and everything that's good. Hey there, person. I'm Mona. Way long so this is probably the, the same dialogue we had before, I mean, right? Tell me everything you Ever since way long. Yeah, this, yeah, yeah, way yeah, yeah, is yeah, 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 I will. Okay, that was all business as usual. The upper left spot. Okay, okay, now we start fighting here immediately. Got me with that little bit surprised there. And I roasted him. I think that has a cooldown though, so we have to wait here. Gotcha down, though I would have preferred to not get hit in the process. Got some e coins to spend though. Hook activated. Okay, I guess that's nice. Ah, here. We know how to use this. The good old grappling hood. Hi there, buddies. What the fuck? Burn, baby! Oh, you, you hurt her, you hurt her, you hurt her. Okay, I need to be a lot more observant now, I can tell. Logistics terminal, funk cells, different weapons, we know, we know, we know, we don't care. Not for the moment, at the very least. And we can recharge some of our health in here. Oh, not so too much, though, but I guess it has to be this way. There's... 
Another hint. Wall jump. Oh, that's nice. Interesting. Can wall jump? I never knew. There's a Mother Moon. I can't afford it. Because we don't have that e-coinage on us. Sadly so. Can I destroy these two? I can! Giving me quite a few resources. Yeah, I see, I see. What is this? Leaks, Long Sheet Town, the gray area. I'm not gonna read that. I am not going to read that. Okay, I was supposed to be able to do wall jumps. Okay, that's the X. I know how they use the X. Going down here. I do not know if there's fall damage that I can suffer from. What is this? Hook activated. Okay, that allows us to progress somewhere else. I'm pretty, pretty sure this was the spot where I would meet that one character, right? So let's actually not go there. Let's actually not go there. Instead, we're gonna see if we can... Pick up something over here. It's a flying axe. Okay, that was not worth it at all. That was not worth it at all, but fine. Be careful. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Even just skipping out of the entire cutscene that happened previously and just beating the these guys up. Put the word out. Whoever kills him gets a 500k reward. There's also now more guys around in here, apparently. Boom, baby. Enjoy getting roasted. Take the cooldown. Oh, I was blasted. I was being blasted there, and I hate that. But the yeah. e-coins keep coming. I was looking at my e-coins counter there. He got me good. Oh. Down you go. Oh, I need to be very careful of me. How do I use a healing item? Did the game tell me that? Uh, left tap. I see. That took a long time until it went off, though. You fucking worm. My god, the language in this game, though. The language in this game. Hey, arm. You have a lot more than just your arm to worry about. Is there something I can jump up to here? That might be doable. If I get the jumping timing just right. Yeah, buddy! I'm so good. That's right! That's, That's right! There's an orb. I want this. But I can't pick it up while I am in combat. I see how it is. And it burns. Oh, he gave me the Wilhub screen. <laughs> of course he did. Skill chip CD. I'm gonna take that one because I actually do use the fire burst every now and then. No idea why now I have a fire burst instead of the lightning blast, but it still works out like a charm. No, it's challenges. Challenges offer great rewards, but are risky as well. Know what you're capable of and decide wisely. For the moment, I would just like to progress a little Careful. further. Hi there, buddies. Watch out. I'm watching, all right. I am watching. I am watching you getting roasted and sliced into tiny little pieces what I'm doing in here. So far, so good. I ain't got no stamina. Okay, just hooked up there. Don't need that. I do be needing some healing in here, though. Thank you kindly. There's a robot guy again. I can actually I can actually afford some of these now. Though there isn't really anything that looks like a true true. Actually, Seismic Palm. It has more damage, but a slightly longer cooldown. And there's the Arc. But I can't afford that one. P.O.T. Machine. Weapon locked at the P.O.T. Machines can be purchased from Funk. Do I know what a P.O.T. Machine is? This one, right? But we don't have the necessary resources in order to do anything there. Kind of want to pick up the seismic palm in here. Let's actually do it. Let's actually do it. Uh, bye. So, okay, now I just use the force to push my enemies around. That's good too. That ought to be good too. A golf set. My man letting me allow to slap enemies silly with a golf club. I wonder if I can get a crowbar. I see a baby. Okay, the force push is pretty, pretty cool, though. The force push do be quite a nice, though. I did not have the stamina for another dash there, huh? But the knifing is still doing the trick. 
Oh hi. Oh you. My man's over here. Are doing a very very awkward playstyle in here. I just saw the fire warning symbol there. And I was not sure what it all meant. For the moment, I will resort to not bother about that all that much. I feel like there was an enemy left somewhere. Maybe he died already. So be it. Up here. That's something we can't afford. The blade launcher. Is it really? It is really exactly what it sounds like it would be. Oh hi. Get top, you motherfucker. Man, the oh that blew up in my face. Bad news. Bad news. Bad news. Bad news. Bad news. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. The Willem screens though. I obtained some e-coins for that. Quite a few e-coins at that as well. A uh, potential deserter. We're gonna ignore that. So, gonna drink really, really quick. Just keep me healthy. So I think this works this way. I spend my points in here. As many as I want. And this progress will be indefinitely. So even if I die, that progress will eventually come to fruition. Just allow me to have that weapon long term. That's how I understand it. I hope that is actually how it works, because if it isn't, I'm gonna feel stupid. A boomer's diary? I'm gonna ignore that. I'm gonna ignore you, boomer. Fucking hell. Oh, come on. It's not this bad now, is it? Oh, it is pretty, pretty bad. It was pretty, pretty bad, because there was a lot of stuff flying my way. Oh, one goes down. And another one bites the dust. Yes, yeah, slowly but steadily getting the flow of this game. Enemies. Yeah, yeah, I've, I've noticed the flashing cues. Oh, hi! I made a mistake. I'm still alive, though. Oh, no! I'm still alive somehow, but I died. Sad. Actually sad. But I invest e-coins to unlock a weapon. You know, well, it was not all... Or not. We got something done in here. So what happens now? Death resets the loop. At your apartment, send the cores you collect to empower yourself and go further in the map. Shield detection is risky, but it can block melee attacks and inflict a good hit stun. I don't think I have the stuff for that. And you lose all e-coins when you die, so it was right that we spent them there when we did. Oh, hi. You have to be true to your word. Uh-huh. say I'll kill you. I'll kill you. There was a little bit of a Batman Arkham Asylum kind of game over screen right there and there. I don't like that. That was a very, very nice touch. Alright, we're back in here. I wonder if that quote that we saw there for a moment had some kind of meaning. To disturb your sleep, but there's something really urgent. Uh -huh. Swing by the office once you're done sleeping. Yeah, I know. I know. Is she gonna tell me that every day now? Is that what's going to happen? Let's check this board. This has still not updated, which kind of wonders me, because we have seen quite a few characters at this point. You can also say, oh, I just realized, you can also tell there's a different ongoing investigations that you have to go for. Not much else near yet. Pet the cat. He's actually too shy to pet the cat, is that it? Do I get more maximum HP for that again? Max item reserve increased. Okay, you know what? That works as well. Everyone misses you. When you weren't around, of course, I'm delightful. We don't have any resources to spend to in here. For a meal. If this keeps going on, I, will have to miss I can check in the back now. It's my journal. Oh, we already seen that before. Alright, I think we're gonna end it here. But the demo seems pretty, pretty promising. I'm definitely looking forward to see more of the full project. It looks like it is going to be more of a roguelite, but with quite a bit of story drive to it. There is a lot of information that the game throws at you very, very fast and very, very furiously. A lot of characters being introduced, some feeling more important than others. But I think there is going to be something good in a way in here. I'm gonna keep my eyes open for this one. But until then, I've been Daddy the Rat and you've been nothing but amazing. I'll see you in the next video.